so we uh, hear a lot about herd immunity now what is herd immunity herd immunity basically means that when a majority of people in a country uh, if they get immunity either because of the vaccine or because of the infection then uh, herd immunity kicks in and those who were not infected or who did not get the vaccine also start getting protection that's basically the bottom line so it varies it it is applies to almost all the vaccines or all the infections uh, including measles or pneumonia and all that so uh, for each virus or each bacteria the level of herd immunity is different how much a proportion of population should get uh, this kind of immunity to call that herd immunity has come in the picture mm, that varies and for covid-19 so far nobody knows there are some speculations that this is around 60% or so so if 60% of people if they are infected then then the herd immunity may come in picture now herd immunity is not very different from vaccine so your vaccination is actually going to add to the immunity that is already prevalent in your herd uh, that is caused by the infection so vaccines are going to actually accelerate your herd immunity the moment we have herd immunity then things might start getting better and the infection might start declining to a great extent and with this uh, with achievement of a great coverage of vaccine actually we will be able to eradicate the virus and that is when things might start getting back to normal right that is when the government authorities might feel that okay now the immunity has been uh, is, is is seen in majority of the people maybe 80 90% of the people and there is no need now no concern about circulation of the virus we can uh, take our guard a little lower our guard a little down and then we can slowly taper down our precautions so that is so that to that to uh, happen the vaccination must continue and majority of the people must take the vaccine that's a very very important thing that we should remember